going on everybody? It's your boy Marcus Ross. Look, G W M. Greatness within movement. Now your boy's been on a journey for the last couple years, and if some of you guys are watching my Instagram post, my Snapchat post, you'll see three words: embrace, empower, and embody. Your boy is finally on the year where he's actually going to give this to the world. All right, so basically it's a journey in which we learn to not only embrace our greatness, be empowered by our greatness, but also embody the very idea of greatness. And this is what I'm going to be showing you guys throughout my whole entire journey as far as my successes, my accomplishments, my, but most importantly, my failures. The things that have got me to where I am today, and I'm going to be showing you guys my life. All right? All right, great people. So I have one question one simple concept for you today the question is who are you no I know that sounds like a real simple question but it's real who are you are you exactly what your family wants you to be are you what your job wants you to be or are you what your relationship says where he or she says that you're this person and that you need to be this person for them now I know what it feels like to be kind of confused as far as your passion and the things that you do like and then what society and everyone outside of your own mind is telling you to be. Trust me, I was there at a place where I felt like I didn't even know what I really wanted to do or I started questioning whether I really want to start motivating people. But now here, I'm going to give you a couple concepts that's going to be able to help you overcome those obstacles and help you on the path of finding out who you truly are. Step one. Embrace your dislikes. Let me say it again. Embrace your dislikes. What I mean by these dislikes is all the things you do not want in your life. Well, I understand. Some of y'all not liking your job. Some of y'all not liking school. Some of y'all not liking bills. You have to understand where you are at as a person. How are you going to know what a good circumstance feels like if you haven't experienced a bad one? How are you going to know what a good relationship feels like if you haven't experienced a bad one? How are you going to know what a good job feels like if you haven't experienced a bad You have to understand that this is going to build you up and to make you a better person. So again, step one, embrace the dislikes. Step two, y'all, be empowered by what you do like. See, now that you know the things that you don't like, those are the very steps to know what you do like and what you do want in your life. See, it's not just the outward circumstances. You have to imagine and visualize and focus. So wherever your focus goes, that's where your energy flows. You have to focus on being the person that you really, really want to be. Well, then how, how do I do that? How, how, how do I become this? You start acting on it. Be motivated on where it's going to actually get you. Be empowered. Not by the process. Be empowered with the result and the goals that you want. And this leads me to the third and final concept, people. Embody. Embody is something that you become. It's accepting an idea. And now that you're empowered by that idea, you start embodying it. You start acting it out. You start speaking on it. Visualizing the very thing that you want. That's when your life starts to change. The moment you take the step of embracing where you're at, accepting it and acknowledging it, be empowered, know where you want to go, and then embody it. The moment we embrace this, people, is the moment you'll start understanding what true greatness is. And start understanding who you really are. Hey everybody, this is your boy Demarcus. Hey, if you like the video that you watched today and it touched you and you feel like it's going to be able to touch somebody else, please like, share, comment, subscribe. Greatness is within you. It's time to start sharing it with the world, all right? It's your boy, Marcus Ross.